Yo, everybody, morning marketing report. Today is Monday, May 4th. Rents are going to be due and late after tomorrow. So it is the middle of collection. Um, as we enter into the May, kind of leave back the tighter restrictions of shelter in place. We've seen a little bit of market flurry and activity. My phone's been blowing up regarding my listings. Uh, a couple of listing appointments set for this week, uh, a couple tours of some new listings. So it feels like the market is back alive. All right, let's go on to the listings today. We have this four bed, two bath, 2,000 square foot for 1.275 over on Laurel. Uh, really cool property. I have uh, a future listing that should be coming up shortly that kind of comps to this one in terms of location and in terms of size. So this is a really interesting one to me to kind of keep an eye on. Uh, it looks like it might be virtually staged right there. And as you can see, it's got the hardwood floors. It's 2,000 square foot. It's right by the heart of downtown. Uh, this is a pretty cool property. And obviously, on Laurel with these tall ones, you get some pretty cool ocean views. I think uh, 1 2 to a little bit below 1 3 is pretty accurate price point. It's hard to find something in PG with this much house in this good of a location. So I'm, I'm pretty excited about this property. I think it's a good value. Uh, and then over on Kimball, and my phone's actually kind of blown up about this one. Uh, a lo little bit of an interesting story here. Uh, so we're looking at three beds. We're looking at two baths, newly remodeled. It's really drawing some attention. This does not look like a seaside backyard to me. Is that grass? What? Grass on sand. It is just very rare to see a grass lawn in Seaside, and I think that is a huge attracting feature. Um, but obviously, uh, we're looking at 1,400 square foot, pretty good sized property. I think we had two good listings hit on the market in these regards. One price decrease uh, over on San Juan Road, and this is a Carmel listing uh, up in the Carmel Woods. It went from 469, so let's call it 470, down to 1430. Uh, so it took a forty thousand dollar price decrease. I think that is in line. Uh, what do we see? Three to thirteen hundred square foot. Uh, I had one of a competing listing on the market. We just went into escrow on this one over in the Carmel Woods. When I say competing, it was a three two with a similar square footage footprint. Um, so that was one that was interesting and. Transaction fell through. Let's see who fell through. 312 First Street in PG. Originally listed at 779, 699. Man, 2-1 is pretty small, obviously, but being under 700,000 in PG, um, it's always pretty desirable. And if you've been paying attention in the last few weeks, even to two months, that sub $1 million price point in PG is rock solid well as you can see there wasn't a ton of activity today that pretty much lays it down if you want to get in and you want to see anything i'll be out and around town i have a couple appointments i'm going to be seeing this one on tuesday so if you want to hear my opinion on it let me know or anything else that new to hit the market otherwise i'll hear from you soon later